I drove over six hours to pick her up. Oh my goodness! Oh my god! I knew I wanted to help out and foster during quarantine. Come here! Come here! She was a little nervous at first. Her name is Aspen, and I'm bringing this puppy home. Oh, you're seeing my first kitty. She was found as a stray in the streets of Fresno, California. It's official. <laughs> I already have 10 rescue dogs, so I figured what's one more for a few weeks. Before we headed out, I wanted to slowly introduce her to the pack, make sure everyone was feeling good, and it went so well. How amazing! Hey Tony, what do you think? Is she cool? I knew that I'd only have her for a short amount of time. Because puppies this cute usually get adopted quickly, I wanted to take her on an adventure of a lifetime. We decided to really social distance and go on a camping trip. Remember everyone, six feet, six feet apart. So I'm getting as far away from people as possible right now. Is this better than the shelter? Yeah, this isn't so bad, is it? We've been hiking, exploring, and enjoying this beautiful weather. Look at you! Good girl. I really can't believe how quickly she became part of the pack. Yeah, you puppy. You found your spot? You like that bed? After a few nights of camping, we headed to Tahoe where we live. Yeah, get comfy. Home sweet home. Yeah, this is where we're gonna be hanging. <laughs> she really fits right in. This is Coda. I named her Coda. It's her first time in the snow. That we know of. I completely fell in love with this dog. I was going to adopt her myself, but then something completely unexpected happened. Hey everyone, I hope you're doing great. So basically, I took her in for a checkup yesterday and the veterinarian immediately starts getting teary-eyed. She had a husky for 12 years. Her husky had passed away less than a week ago and she's explaining to me like all the things they did together. She's really painting this beautiful picture. By the way, she then tells me that her little girl is home from school because of the coronavirus. I, I felt like I knew what I needed to do because I can't think of a family who, who needs a dog now more than ever. And I said, you know, I didn't tell you this, but I'm, I'm fostering this dog. And if you want to bring her home to your daughter, then you can and she broke down and it started hugging me. She's a veterinarian. The dog is gonna have all the care she could ever ask for. You know, it's just a beautiful thing. Yes, I'm definitely sad. Like, I miss the dog. I, I really love this dog, you know? This is for the best. That's it, guys. Stay safe. Bye. Si amas a los animales, suscríbete.